I'm excited to see how my results turn out. So I'm home, icing my lips. You can see a little of the bruising starting. It is what it is. Doing 10 minutes on, 10 minutes off. Um, and then I've gotta do my first massage. I'm gonna use a little like oil or lotion and then essentially gotta massage all the sculpture in. And then also, um, you can't see it because it's backwards, it's Arnica tablets. I found my Arnica, so I'm gonna take that. And then I also have some Arnica gel to put on my face. Um, Arnica is a natural homeopathic um, ingredient that supposedly helps with bruising and swelling. I know it's big in like crunchy circles, but it's also actually pretty popular in like cosmetic injury, like plastic surgery, all that stuff too. So they look like little teething tablets because it's highlands and they just go under your tongue and dissolve. It tastes fine. Yeah, so this is how it gets a little crazy. Uh, definitely a little swollen. I'm going to go ice. <laughs> ice myself. Um, don't worry. It's not going to look like this. But I do have to take my kids to swim lessons today. Maybe I'll wear a mask. Good morning. It is the next day, so... Not quite 24 hours after, but you can see some of the swelling. I have um, definitely some more fullness right here because I know that she put stuff in to try to really help with the nasolabial folds. Um, so that's just a little interesting to get used to, but it goes away. I know um, Sculptra, the fullness, um, it's not really a filler. It's, <laughs> there's Bert, my cat. Um, it's not really a filler. It does dissolve and then it's supposed to stimulate the collagen production. Um, let me get going on my massage. Just like last time, I don't really see a ton of bruising. Um, last time I think I thought I had a bunch of bruising here, but it's like my melasma as well. Um, so I've got just like a little bit and it's sore right here. Um, she did some right here. I don't know if this is bruising, melasma, mustache, what it is. Um, so I'm just doing some massaging. For Sculptra Aftercare, you are supposed to massage it five times a day for five minutes. I'm not the best with doing it for a full five minutes because I mean, I don't have the attention span but um, it doesn't hurt, it's just a little sore, um, so it's fine. I'm just trying to make sure I remember to go in all the areas, because she did stuff right here, here. Um, the face, my face is a little fuller, I noticed that, um, but essentially it's gonna all dissolve, and then the idea is that um, my body will stimulate the collagen um, as she mentioned yesterday, you can definitely see um, a difference from my first session. Uh, I let them take, you know, as many pictures and videos and things as they want, since clearly I'm filming this, so why not let them? Um, my lips actually aren't as swollen as I thought they'd be. Um, you can see little bruising, um, but it will keep going down. And the bruises, I think for me, typically last like a week and a half, maybe. Um, but it's easy enough to cover up with some lipstick so um after i'm done with my massage i'll go get ready and then i'll come back and show you um what i look like now with makeup on all right so here i am back after makeup i don't know what led me to make these choices today um i think it kind of exaggerates everything rather than tones it down so I would definitely not normally do my makeup like this. Um, not happy with it. Hi everyone, it is day three. So today is uh, Thursday and yeah. I had my three, I had my <laughs> injections on 
Tuesday. So I have this one here because she has speech today. So she wanted to be in the video with me. But I thought I would come on and show you what it's looking like. My lips have a little bruising. I'd say this is much better than when I got them. Yeah, lips. Much better than when I got them done last time. Um, this I'm pretty sure is my melasma. This may be a bruise. Maybe a little bruising. But really not bad. Um, I think the swelling... Um, and the puffiness in my face is kind of going down. I feel like my lines here are a little more noticeable, but I know, I know that it's going to get better. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty pleased with how it's coming down. I know that a lot of, <laughs> I got quite a few messages from people yesterday being like, oh my gosh, what did you do? So I know people were worried that I was becoming like, I don't know, did something that was a bad choice or, um, you know, just starting to go wild. Uh, there's, I had to assure everyone, I was like, trust the process, trust the process. I promise it's gonna be okay. But I've been sharing it just so people can see. Um, so yeah, I think, I think this looks fine. Yeah, what do you think? Cheese. Cheese. Yeah. Um, so, I think it's coming around just fine and I'll keep you posted on the results. I am now six to seven days post injections from Sculptra and Lip Filler. Um, today is Monday and they were done last Tuesday. So yeah, just thought I'd give you a little insight. Sorry, I just ran up the stairs. <laughs> Um, no matter how many stairs you climb all the time, sometimes when you just go up them, it just gets you. Okay, so. Just trying to relax so you can see. My facial puffiness went down. My lips are just so little. I think they're still a little swollen. I'm not sure. But if not, oh well. I like them. Um, and then, done with all my massaging. And now it's just general maintenance trut, etc. So. Hello, hello. It is about six weeks after my Sculptra and lip filler, so I thought I'd kind of give a update that was a little further out than the ones I had previously recorded. Um, hold on. And I definitely see a difference, especially when I look in pictures. Um, can see a difference here. Um, my under eyes are less pronounced. I'm sorry, I ran up the stairs again. I keep doing that. Um, and my lips are definitely less swollen. Happy with them. Um, you're in the Orlando area, definitely hit up the Institute for Aesthetic Surgery. It's a plastic surgery office, so not just a little like med spa boutique type place. It's a plastic surgery office and they're all highly trained and I will say the prices were great comparable to any med spa and then you know you have the actual training and follow-up process there um, and then also the staff is also sweet so I highly recommend them happy with my results so far um, I think it's going to take a couple more weeks maybe even months um, for the full results to show and then I have one more session in December I will definitely share it with you guys